Hey everybody, it's Josh here. In this video, I've got a quick Divi tutorial for you. I'm gonna show you how to create a full width section in Divi. So I've got some content started for us. I've got an image on the left and some text on the right. And we're gonna pretend like we want to come up with this type of look where the image is taking up the full left hand part of the screen and same thing with the content on the right. Now, not too long ago, Divi had an option to where you could just click a button and things would just magically go full width. However, back in, and it looks something like this, back on version 3.2, 2.1 to 3.22, this was deleted. And I actually have a tutorial on where that button went because it disappeared. And I show you this trick, but I wanted to kind of do a new version of this tutorial because I get this question asked all the time. So again, we want to make this full width. Now, what's interesting is that every section in Divi is technically full width. So for example, if you're brand new to Divi, sections are in blue, rows are in green, which is what we actually, we want all of the content in our row to be full width. So technically this tutorial should be how, how do you make a row full width in Divi, not the section, but uh, most people just view this as section. So let me show you how to do this. So again, the section behind the row, if I were to change this background color, the section behind this is already full width. But again, we wanna make the content of the row full width. Very easy. All you need to do is go to the settings icon in the row, go to design, and then sizing, and then let's bring this to the center. Check this out. There are two width settings. Now, back in the day, this is where that button used to be. However, uh, it's not there anymore, but it's still a super easy fix. And before you get mad at the team at Elegant Themes, I'm sure there's a reason they did that, probably something with the new column structures, but this is very easy. All you need to do is adjust the width and then the max width, because watch this. If I go to 100%, it didn't do anything, it didn't change a thing. And that's because the max width of all of my sections, which is actually set here in the theme customizer, is set to 1080, which is standard for Divi. Now you could just drag the max width like this, and that's fine, but here's the problem. Once you get to this point here, it may look fine on your screen, but if you have a high res screen or a really big screen, uh, it may not be full width. So let me show you this little hack that's super handy when you make a full width section. And that is to kind of trick the system and just call this 100%. You don't have to use pixels, just like you see it up here. So now, with the width set at 100% and the max width set at 100%, this is a full width section. And if we look at it on tablet, you can see the entire row is going left to right. Same thing on phone, super easy, super cool. And then all you need to do is, if you did wanna keep on adjusting this further, uh, you could adjust the padding on the top and the bottom. So I could adjust the top padding and I could adjust the bottom padding to make sure there's no spacing. Uh, and then you could do the same thing for the uh, section behind it. So I could go to the section behind here and just reduce that padding on the top and bottom. And if you're curious how I'm doing the top and the bottom, I'm holding down shift alt, super handy trick in Divi. And there we go, guys. There is a full width section. Now, a couple things we're gonna do here, uh, this is kind of part one of a two-part tutorial. I'm gonna show you how to center this text right here, and uh, we're gonna make this look really, really cool. This is actually also based off a free layout that I have. Uh, this is a free layout you can download on my site, and it's got the same design. Uh, if you'd like to have this as a library item that you can just use for all your sites, you are welcome to download this for free and you'll be good to go. So on the next tutorial, I'll show you how to center this. And then just as a reminder, if you want to get to know Divi more, I have a Divi WordPress beginners course. I'll show you the ins and outs of Divi. That way you can learn it quick and you can get going to building some awesome sites really quick with WordPress and Divi. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Make sure you click that subscribe button below to get more tutorials like this. I try to do at least one video per week and I've got a lot in the works here to put out for you soon so hit that subscribe button check out my Divi beginners course and then again I've got a, this as a free layout for you but in any case just make sure you go again to recap just go into your row settings design go to sizing and just make sure your width is 100% max width at 100% and you guys are good to go you can make any section you want full width all right see you guys in the next tutorial where we're going to actually automatically vertically center this text